Hey guys, Johnny Jiggins here. Got a pretty cool little video. I want to title this "Being Noticed uh, as a YouTuber or on, or as a fisherman." Man, I had I've had some pretty cool things happen. You know, I've been working on this YouTube thing for several years, and you know, started growing the fan base and getting some people liking my videos and, and stuff like that. And you know, I was noticed for the first time uh, back in February at the Bassmasters Classic, and that was really cool to be noticed. Granted, it, it was still a fishing event, so you know, you're going to have people from the fishing industry and there was probably I'm sure there was a lot of people that knew of me and didn't say anything just because I had a lot of people looking at me and stuff granted I had a GoPro on my head um, but uh, I think that had something to do with it I think there was people that noticed me don't don't it won't, um, the, the main thing with this video is gonna be if you see me on the water or you want to talk to me man message me talk to me if you especially if you've got questions I use them for videos uh, so you know if you see me and you want to talk to me if you see me at an event you see me at I mean, a tournament, a seminar, or whatever, come talk to me, man. I love this kind of stuff. This is a big part of what we live for is being noticed for something that we love doing and that we're good at. That's just real cool. It's real fun. So um, I was noticed there. A group of guys had, had noticed me. And then uh, recently, only about a, two months ago or so, my uh, stepdad is uh, is doing is at work or whatever, and they're talking about fishing just casually, whatever, right? And... The guy that my stepdad is working for, he 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 says, "Hey, I've been trying to get into bass fishing, and I've been watching this one guy on YouTube." And Ken was like, "Oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool." And he says, His "Name is Johnny Jenkins." And Ken was like, "Well, that's my stepson. He's he's staying in my house right now. How odd is that? You know, the guy didn't bring up anything about me or anything like that from what he said. You know, to automatically say this is the guy I'm watching, and that's just that's just cool, man. That's special." That's cool. That's pretty darn cool. That's when I'm like, wow, I'm reaching, I'm reaching some people, and I'm surprised how local people I'm reaching because, you know, I don't advertise a whole lot that I'm from Georgia, do I? I don't think I do. So, you know, that that's pretty cool. And then recently, I was out on lake. This is pretty cool, man. Uh, I got off work at about 10 o'clock at night, and then I, I decided I'm gonna hook the boat up and go to the lake. And uh, I fished all night long into the early morning. Now this is a Sunday morning or Saturday morning, so I knew there was gonna be some tur there was probably gonna be a tournament, and I'm way down here and and lately I've been thinking about how much I want a Phoenix boat and it's kind of funny how this happened uh, this guy rolls up in a real nice Phoenix uh, very fairly similar to the one that the kind that I would really want and he rolls up and I'm like wow that's pretty cool as a Phoenix and I'm fishing and I know he's in a tournament I can just tell and I, I'm fishing this offshore rock pile and you know I know there's a lot of fish in the area and then um, I go down and I fish down this the shoreline fishing a frog and I, I get a bite Solid three pound fish. I'm not sure if you saw it, but Brian Washburn, if you're watching this, appreciate you reaching out to me. It was pretty cool. Um, and as soon as I got that bite, I'm like, you know what? My day's coming to an end anyway. I'm going to go ahead and just roll out of here and let him have this because I know he can catch some fish down through here. So I pulled up the trolling motor, and as I was getting ready to leave, he, he stopped me. He said, Hey, you, you, you do YouTube? And I was like, Yeah, I was really surprised because I kept seeing him eye me, and I thought it was just the typical fisherman thing. And once he's fishing, is he catching anything type, type deal? I do it all the time. Um, so, you know, he stopped me and we talked for a couple minutes and whatnot. And he told me he's been watching my videos. Unfortunately, he told me he's been fishing some of my spots, which was <laughs> a bit of a surprise. Uh, <laughs> I almost don't want to show some of the stuff. I need to start looking for some new fish that some of these guys don't know about. I've been doing some of that. But, uh, um, so, you know, it is what it is. But it's pretty cool, man. That, that's all stuff. If you ever see me in public at a seminar, at a tournament, whatever, anything like that, man, come talk to me. If you have questions, you can message me, YouTube, Facebook, I got a fan page, all that Instagram, all that social media stuff, Google Plus, any question you have. Once again, these questions, I'm doing videos on these, um, you know, so go ahead and ask them. I mean, anything. I've got people that ask me a lot of questions, so, you know, just keep them rolling, man, and keep, you know, if you want to interact. I've got plenty of ways now nowadays where you can interact with people um, and, and whatnot, so if you, if you like doing that, go ahead. But anyway, this is pretty cool if... Uh, the day that I get noticed outside of the fishing industry for YouTube, that'll be a cool day. That'll be a pretty cool day. So I'll talk to you guys later. Um, go ahead and check out some of my other videos. I'll talk to you guys later.